There are a few homes right across from Lambeau Field that show off their Packers pride. This morning, our own Emily Deem is getting a tour of one of those homes. She's live in Green Bay with more. Hi, Em. Good morning, Rachel and Pete. Hi, everybody. Yeah, we're on Shadow Lane this morning in Green Bay checking out an ultimate Packers party home this morning. I have Tom Verbencore who is here with me with Robinson Metal. Tom, good morning to you. Good morning. Okay, we're in the bathroom this morning, but <laughs> yeah, tell us why. Show us some really cool stuff you have in here. Well, in the men's room, uh, we noticed at that Lambeau Field that we didn't have any place to put the beer. So we made some uh, shelves for the beer shelves for all, all of the men's rooms at Lambeau Field. That is so cool. And you have it inside your Packers party home out here. Let's work our way down the hallway because we're in the men's room. But <laughs> ladies, they have a special area just for you too. So okay. it's, this place is strictly only for tailgating. Rachel, check yeah. this bathroom out. How cool. I could read a book in here. This is so nice. Sit on the chair. Tell me about these stalls, Tom, and where you guys got them. Those are just uh, regular commercial stalls that you would see uh, in any commercial uh, uh, restroom, but we, we bought them from one of our, one of our vendors, and they, they had them painted green for us, and we wanted them to look real, real, real nice and clean for everybody. And yeah, and you refurbished this home. You got it in about 2009. Take a look at the living room where people can come and sit and enjoy. And this place, though, is strictly for tailgating. Who comes out here for you guys? Well, family, friends, vendors, customers. Uh, the house is kind of set up for, you know, if the gals want to warm up a little bit. Most of the guys are out in the garage yucking it up with each other <laughs> for the game. But, you know, if they want to come in and they got somebody a, little, somebody a little older, your grandma comes and she's got a nice place to come and, you know, warm up. This is the place to be. And, you know, he was talking about the outside because that's where the garage is and the picnic tables and everything. <laughs> That's where all of the food is, you guys. From festival, they bring in tons of food. They have a buffet style. It's unbelievable. But they do have a few refreshments, too. John Gerzak is here with me with Gerzak Liquor. Good morning to you, John. How are you this morning? I am doing fabulous because you guys yeah. really bring it. We do. Uh, out here for the ultimate tailgating experience. Uh, we shot some video earlier. Let's bring that up to show everybody what you do. So tell me what you bring out. Well, basically, we have the beer, the, the liquors, the water, sodas. And all I do is, after every home packer game, and that stuff, I'll come the next day, re-inventory everything out for them, and then have everything restocked for the next game. You know, this is packed, so how many, you know, do you go through a lot of kegs of beer for them, or how much would you go through? They do real well. I said anywhere from three to five halves a game, case to two cases of liquor, 10 cases of soda, five cases of water, it's just phenomenal. But I said there is a difference between a 12 o'clock game versus say the uh, seven o'clock game like tonight. They should be hitting it pretty good. Yeah, they should be having some nice refreshments and even take a look at this great cup that they have outside. You guys, go pack. We're ready for the game today. Thanks so much for joining us, John. Robinson Metal, Packers Party Home. It's pretty amazing. We'll send it back to Living you. Living the life. Thanks, Sam. Yeah.